Rather than lead in space, too often we've chosen to drift. And as we learned 60 years ago, when we drift, we fall behind. Our struggle to define the direction and purpose of America's space program dates back decades to the post-Apollo period. We had just won the race to the moon, and suddenly the question became, what should we do? Where should we go next? In the debate that followed, sending Americans to the moon was treated as a triumph to be remembered, but not repeated. Every passing year that the moon remained squarely in the rearview mirror further eroded our ability to return to the lunar domain and made it more likely that we would forget why we ever wanted to go in the first place. And now we find ourselves in a position where the United States has not sent an American astronaut beyond low Earth orbit in 45 years. Across the board, our space program has suffered from apathy and neglect. America's abdication of leadership in space has spurred our nation to action once more. And just as with Sputnik six dec decades ago, we have resolved with the leadership of President Donald Trump to never again let America fall behind in the race for space. By reviving the National Space Council, President Donald Trump has declared to all of the world, America will lead in space once again.